Good evening. University and Manal opened within the hour after a semi rollover earlier today had traffic blocked in all directions. Investigators are piecing together what happened. News 13's Jackie Kent spoke with witnesses. Yeah, Lizé, crews had to move 90,000 pounds of glass the semi was hauling. APD says the crash happened about 9 this morning. Officer Simon Drobik says police are looking into whether the driver of the semi or the van may have run a red light. The crash sent the semi on its side, just nearly missing the smoke shop. Across the intersection, an employee at Little Anita's says she and customers heard a loud boom from the crash, and her general manager, Joseph Lindsay, was quick to step in to help the drivers. He ran to the truck to try to get the gentleman out of the diesel truck. And then as they got that man out safely, because there was fluids going everywhere, they ran to get the gentleman out of his van because it started to smoke. The restaurant employee says she saw a pedestrian who may have been injured as well, but police have not confirmed whether a third person was involved. Police say the woman driving the van went to the hospital, though they didn't know the extent of her injuries. The driver of the semi was checked out at the scene and is okay. Lizay, back to you. Okay, Jackie, police are still investigating what caused that crash.